Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2018-19 Panini Select Basketball. Full case, 12 boxes. Pick your team number three. There you go. On the 7th, on a Thursday night, if you see those rooftops next to your name, carrots, I think they call them. Those are the teams that people picked up in the spot random. I'm not sure who the last spot mojo was in Select Basketball for people who purchase teams straight up. This is very important. Let's figure that out. That additional mojo is pretty important. The last spot picked up was Joseph Matthews. Matthews with one T, just like Ryan Matthews picked up the Clippers. That was Last Spot Mojo. Anthony was Last Spot Mojo in the spot random. He got himself the Grizz. All right. Good luck, Joe. Thanks, everybody. Here is the full fresh case right here. Plucked straight out of the big hit tree. So hopefully there'll be big hits in here. Straight from our big hit garden. Scott was asking, do you know if Andrew Luck and Peyton Manning autos are in contenders this year? May, if they are, they'd be extremely short printed in contenders football. I'm, I don't know about, if you're wondering about contenders optic football, that I do not know. Um, I would check the checklist on cardboardconnection.com. You may be able to find those there. I think they might be actually. It might be one of those short printed like Legends autos or something like that. All right, so there are all 12 right here. Good luck, everybody. Remember, three autographs or memorabilia cards per box on average. Joe, didn't I get in this one? Did you tell me? <laughs> Did you? This is Pick Your Team 3. I see you with no orders for Pick Your Team 3. Check your, uh, check your receipts. Let's see what break number you are. But don't check your receipts through the website, ladies and gentlemen. It might tell you how much you've spent at Jaspies. You may not want to know that. But double check your receipts to make sure I didn't screw anything up. Um, ha has Spot Random 16 sold out? No, there's still one left, so it can't happen yet, Jonathan Best. But the schedule right here in the chat is right there. So that could slot into that 8.15 time, time slot right there. Stephen K thinks those autographs are in there, Scott. Contenders Off doesn't have – oh, doesn't have either. They do have T.Y. Hilton, though. So there you go. What does Last Spot Mojo get you? A little extra magic. It really doesn't mean anything, or does it? Depends on how superstitious you are. But I guess if you're if you're into this group breaking sort of thing, then I guess uh, everyone does have a little superstition here and there. But whenever a team, whenever the last team is remaining, or if the last spot is remaining on any break, whoever gets that last spot to help close out the break will be awarded a little star next to their name. It means they get last spot mojo, which could mean a little extra magic. We always say that 70% uh, of the time, last spot mojo hits every time. Ooh, look at this. That's a nice one. Robert, watch the throne with the Mavs. 36 out of 99, Luka Doncic. Nice. Nice Phenom card right there and silver. And we got Damari Carroll, Jazz Edition. 
Melanie close four is closed out. Break four is actually not closed out. We still have to do that spot random, Melanie. But thank you for grabbing the last team in pick your team four. Then we just got to move 11 spots in the basketball spot random where everyone has a chance to win a, or everyone who joins that break has a chance at a sealed box of this, plus teams. We got Mo Bamba. So the uh, Damari Carroll Jazz Edition goes to Ed Ram, and the Mo Bamba goes to uh, Chris Perrin, who got the magic in a spot random. Nice. 37 out of 199. There's Jeff Teague, copper, to 60. And we'll sleeve and top load all of those before, they, uh, before it goes out. Just in the interest of time, we'll just set those aside. We'll save one of those Jaron Jackson Juniors, too. There's Draymond, X-Factor Relic. And there's Taj Gibson to 149. Yeah, people seem to like the Mo Bamba a lot. Trevor, doesn't he have a song? I think, someone's, doesn't he, I think he has a song named after him from, from some hip hop artist. There's Gerald Green, Rockets to 299. Rajon Rondo die cut to 175. We'll sleeve up these die cuts right away and top load them just to protect them. Out of 175 on that Rondo. Uh, the Gerald Green is to 299. There's Miritich, Gobert, Doncic, Tricolor. I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> With those two Donchiches right there, I'll bet a, I'll bet a quarter of the spot is paid for already. I'm not even kidding. And we got Luca's future teammate, Porzingis, die cut to 65. This will still go to the Knicks, though. That'll go to Sky. All right, next box. Good luck. AOB Poker, what's up? How do you change your email address for your account? You can go to your My Account page on jazbeescasebreaks.com and change it there. If it's for an order that's uh, for a break that's already completed, just shoot us an email, jazbeescasebreaks at gmail.com, and let our shipping team know. Any Luca Inc.? No, not yet. But we're just, we just started this full case break, so you never know. This could be the one. Pull some nice parallels, though. But thing is, even without the autographs, those parallels actually sell very well. So, so that's why all of these, all of those cards, they all add up, which is kind of crazy. There's a uh, Eldon Campbell, old school Laker right there, little Laker Joe Mojo for Elvis Ekman. Out of one ninety nine, Trevor saying. Switching over to football a little bit. Saw saw in the New Orleans news. Is that the New Orleans Picayune, maybe? Is that Antonio Brown might be considering the Saints? Does he have a choice? He has to be traded, right? Unless the Steelers are willing to accommodate him. There's Lonnie Walker, the fourth. Three out of ten. That card is gold. 
That will be for the Spurs. That's for Melanie with the Spurs. Three out of ten. Nice. Who'd you get, Brandon? Brandon said he pulled two one of ones out of Prism NASCAR. There's Miles Bridges out of two ninety nine. Is there isn't a, I'm not entirely sure, exactly sure where it is, but there has to be like a, a place where you can update your information somewhere, your profile or something like that. I don't know right off the top of my head where it is. Out of 65, die cut Chris Middleton. Nice, Jimmy Johnson and uh, Martin Truex Jr., nice. There's Vince Carter, Vinsanity, the Ageless Wonder, a cyborg maybe. How do you play that long without maybe having some robot parts? Throwback memorabilia for the Mavs. That goes to Robert Throne. Redemption. Kemba Walker to 199. Um, AOB, I'll try to, I mean, it's, it's going to be a while before this break is over, but I'll try to, uh, if you're still around after this break, or if you check in in between breaks, I'll try to, uh, figure that out for you. But in the meantime, just email us. All right. EA opened a heritage box. You got nothing? There was, it was just empty? It's Gerald Green. Signatures, neon green, prisms, green, green. Gerald Green's a, a rocket, right? How am I blanking on it? Oh, nothing good. I see. All right, um, group break checklist. This is card number 14. Gerald Green, card number 14. He is a rocket. Has he always been a rocket? Maybe. Trevor is saying that WWL TV saying trading Michael Thomas to get him. Wow. I'd rather hold on to Michael Thomas, maybe? Isn't Michael Thomas younger? Colin Carver saying Vince Carter actually came out and said he's returning next year. If teams are still interested. He's a cyborg. He has to be. I agree with you, Scott. Scott Scott is saying Vince is a machine. I think he literally is part machine. Somewhere in the offseason, you know, deep in the Swiss Alps, there is probably a, a place where you can get that kind of kind of surgery. He has, some of his joints have been replaced with robot robotic parts. That's how he keeps going. Just the same with Yarmir Yager. He's also a cyborg. Right. Part machine, part man. There's Jaron Jackson Jr. die cut to 249. And Mo Wagner. Piece of his jersey right there. Draft selections jersey for my Lakers. Elvis Ekman with the Lake Show. And the Jaron Jackson Jr. Anthony P. who got the Grizz in a uh, spot random. Maybe we'll find his autograph in here, Anthony. Out of 249. There's Fred Van Vliet to 199. Remember, we'll sleeve and top load all of those before they go out. And Terry Rozier, 101 to 199. Jersey and auto for Scary Terry. Derwin with the Celtics.
101 out of 199. Robert Williams, a third. Two out of five. Green die cut. For the green Celtics, a little oppo, Joe Mojo. I'm a Lakers guy, Derwin. Two out of five. Still got a train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. Does look pretty cool. LaMarcus Aldridge for the Spurs. To $2.99. Michael Porter Jr. Silver, Marvin Bagley Silver, and Clint Capella for the Rockets. Nice. Lime green Clint Capella for Jeremy33, who got the uh, Rockets in a spot random. Ends up with a key piece of that Rockets team. And the Zaire Smith, Stephen Adams down there too. Nice. All right, Trevor's got some updates for us here. Titans, Saints, and Skins were looking to acquire Antonio Brown, but Saints and Titans backed out as of two hours ago. Steelers won a first-round pick for him. Uh, I know someone. I know a team with a first-round pick that they could give. Is that all they want? Just a first-round pick? Just one? How about how about a late first round pick from my Raiders? Let's give them the Dallas Cowboys pick. My Raiders can give the Steelers the Dallas Cowboys first round pick for Amari Cooper. We turn Amari Cooper into Antonio Brown in just one season. It's actually kind of funny because I think when before like in, in like the preseason and stuff like that or around draft time, Amari Cooper his kind of ceiling was supposed to be like Antonio Brown. I think that was like his comparable. Mr. Beetle, what's going on? EA saying Titans need to go get Eric Weddle. Yeah, he's available too, huh? a lot going to be going on in the NFL free agency. Basketball free agency should be exciting too. There's Rodney Hood out of 175. And Kevin Knox, Fort Knox out of 60, going to Sky and the Knicks. Nice. Rodney Hood die cut for Isaac and the Cavs. To 175. There's Paul Millsap, throwback memorabilia, Jazz, Ed Ram. There's Westbrook, Miles Bridges, Kevin Huter, Gail Goodrich for the Suns. That'll be for Ryan Sullivan and Phoenix. Out of 199. Whoa, that's a nice one coming up. Look at this. This should go for a lot, actually. Ben Simmons. Remember, his autographs are exclusive to Upper Deck. So that makes any of this, even his non-rookie cards and inserts that you find in these Panini sets, could go for a lot. That is 1 out of 10. Gold! Ben Simmons Global Icons card. Someone look that up. That that it might be it might surprise us more than we it might go for more than we think. Michael Neck with the 76ers. Nice. And another Sixer coming up for you. JJ Reddick, jersey and autograph for Michael Neck. Nice. Brandon's thinking a few hundred bucks. That sounds that that I think that could be right. It wouldn't surprise me. So 58 out of 99 for the sharpshooter. 58, is that his uh, three three point percentage? That's no, probably not that high, but. 
Alan Crabb out of 249. Where's Goyle? Crabb and Goyle. Get it? Nah, probably not. Brooklyn Nets. That goes to Tony Barkey. Got randomized the Nets in the spot random. Did I upload that spot random? I did. All right, good luck, everyone. Next box. Just joining us, folks. Schedule is in the chat. If you're wondering when your break is coming up. Um, I know there's an empty time slot in that 815 spot right there. I think, um, I think that Contenders Optic Football sold out. Both the uh, the break itself and the spot rim. Yeah, so that actually slots in there. Chris Hale thinking that, uh, yeah, Weddle is out there. Thinking the Bears should go after him. I think a lot of teams will be going after him, right? Brandon Luger, Seahawks, Eric Weddle. I feel like he'd, he'd fit well in there. Yeah, Landon Collins is an interesting one, too. The Giants just let him go. The New York football Giants who were just like, they didn't even franchise him. I thought they'd do something like that, but, you know, they just let him walk. There's Kemba Walker out of 75. There's Ricky Rubio, blue die cut. What's up, Rory? Oh, apparently the spot random number four has two less spots. Two less or two fewer? Anyway, spots minus two. Thanks, Rory. Rory, I have your uh, Milwaukee Bucks minus 10. Was that a mistake? Luka Doncic? Autograph? Yes, Lulu! Our first Luka Doncic auto. Going to Robert Watch the Throne. And the Dallas Mavericks. 129. There's 199 of these? We should, we should be pulling a lot more of these. Nice Luka Doncic. Nice Lulu autograph. There you go. Robert, watch the throne with the Dallas Mavericks. There's Aaron Gordon die cut to 99. Roy says, not a mistake. They will cover, right. Well, A, Bucks aren't going to lose three in a row, right? I think they lost their last two. There's Robert. Congrats. It's a very nice hit. And don't worry, Brandon. A lot more, lot more of those that we can pull. RPA could be in there for you. Rodney Hood jersey. Throwback memorabilia. Seven out of 49 for the Jazz. Ed Ram. And we got Michael Bridges. Sparks jersey. And that spark will go to Ryan Sullivan with the Suns. There's KD to 299. And sixth box. In this full case break, pick your team three. All right. 
right, good luck. Wait, which guy's a oh yeah, the MH, yeah, that, that Lulu guy's okay from what we hear. Luka Doncic, what, what what is his ceiling, ladies and gentlemen? He's gonna be on all NBA teams, right? First team all NBA? Right? Multiple first team all NBAs? MVP? Hall of Fame? All right, next box. There's Giannis Antetokounmpo. Watching him play right now. There's Chris Dunn, Relic. Throwback memorabilia, Timberwolves. That'll go to Jeremy Tillman and the T-Wolves. Dante DiVincenzo, Zach Levine, and Ray Allen. Autograph. Bucks edition. That goes to Stephen K, who got randomized the Milwaukee Bucks in the spot random. Gets the on-card lime green. Ray Allen, 2 out of 35. Great break so far. We're only halfway through it. CJ McCollum, 20 out of 49. X-Factor. I'm on the Trailblazers tonight as well. That's the game after... This one on TNT. You're welcome, Stephen K. Thanks for uh, thanks for giving that spot random a shot. There's Lonzo. Um, Chris Hale thinking uh, you think he'll start in the All Star game next? I think so. It's part popularity contest, right? So he's already pretty popular. Uh, Two forty nine Lonzo Ball. Do you think he would? Ray, are you saying that you think you think this is I mean what we're seeing in Luca, which is good, but Ray Ray's thinking, well, this might be it though. This might be what we see. Maybe Trey Young has a little more room to grow. Maybe his ceiling's a little bit higher. <laughs> right, yeah, not Ray Allen. Jesus Shuttlesworth. There's Brandon Ingram, 75. Josh Richardson, out of 199. Chris LeVert, to 99 die cut. these up. Craig schedule is in the chat if you want to take a look at that. Should answer your questions. All right. Next box. Good luck. Rory saying he's buying up DeAndre A and stashing for a couple years. He thinks he's gonna make a mint on that. He thinks he's gonna gonna maybe maybe take a an Anthony Davis type progression in his game. I think so too. Ray likes uh, racing. Hey, Mo Bamba, that's your sleeper. 
This has actually been a really good rookie class. It's not, I, I know Luka Doncic is getting all the attention, but a lot of other players to collect and chase and stash. So. There you go. <laughs> Sorry about the Lakers. You don't have to apologize. Chris Hale for the uh, for the Lakers mailing it in. That's what they should do. Not going to make the playoffs. Let's try to get a better, better uh, draft spot. Craig, I'm sorry, Craig, what, what is your question? I agree, Mo Bamba, Wendell Carter Jr., Jaron Jackson Jr., Yeah, Michael Porter Jr. is solid. You know, Michael Porter Jr., I just learned this the other day, was projected as a number one pick before he before those injuries derailed him. All right, there's Colin Sexton. Colin Sexton could be a player too, Isaac, with that one. There's Colin Sexton again, die cut to 175. Is this year's class better than last year's? I mean, we'll find out in a few years, but it seems like there's a little more buzz around this year's rookies than last year's rookies, like from top to bottom, you know? John Raposo likes Kevin Knox out there in New York. There's Javon Carter for the Grizz. Jersey and Otto for Javon Carter, and uh, that goes to... Anthony, who had the Grizzlies in a spot random. Nice. Well, yeah, definitely, Scott. Zion Williamson next year, for sure. But this year's class is pretty strong as well. Right, that's the knock on Michael Porter Jr., right? Those injuries. There's Michael Bridges to 299. But if he can if he can get healthy, it could be huge. There's Andre Drummond, X Factor for the Pistons. Philip Lee with the Pistons. Scott saying Zion's better than Luca. Well not sure about I mean hard to say. I've, I haven't seen Zion play any NBA games. I've seen Luka Doncic play a lot of NBA games. He's pretty good. But if you're saying Zion's better, that'll be a hell of a season for Zion. Out of 249, Jamal Murray die cut. What's great about hoops is that, remember, guys like Jamal Murray, his rookie year, everyone was just like, everyone was like, ah, uh, what a bust. But now, second year turned out to be really nice. There's Michael Porter. He was, he heard us. His ears were burning. All right, next box. Scott needs a wizard. Pull a wizard, he demands. I'll try. Wonder if Nike would try to ex exclusive Zion? Yeah, I'm sure he would. I'm sure they would. I'm sure he'll take it too. Although if if I'm Adidas, right, I would definitely pay up pay up for Zion.
What what's what would be first off? Oh, I don't. I doubt they would do NT first off the line, right? That doesn't. They already did. There's National Treasures basketball first off the line. I'm hearing that that it's already on sale. Anthony Simons and Hamadou Diallo, jersey and autograph for OKC. Jersey and autograph, Ryan Redman. Thanks to Hamadou Diallo, who helped me win a little bit of uh, a little bit of money in the dunk contest. Got some nice dunks. It's got ups. It's got hops. Wendell Carter Jr. die cut. Going to Jeremy thirty three and doubles two forty nine. We got Jeff Teague, 60 out of 60 for the Timberwolves. Mo Bamba Silver and Marvin Bagley, the third draft selections relic. Kings, Anthony with the Kings. Chris Parent with the Mo Bamba. And we've got Markel Fultz, 40 out of 65. Who thinks Markel Fultz will revive his career in Orlando? I'm rooting for him. I hope he does. Pretty bit, pretty huge for Orlando. There's Demontis Sabonis to 199 for the Pacers. There's Kyle Kuzma and Draymond. No, Rory says Fultz is DOA in Orlando. You don't believe? What an odd start to a career for someone who got picked that high. You know, like, I, I, I feel like there could be a Markel Fultz 30 for 30. Gets picked number one overall, but then fiddles with his shot, I guess, in the summer, allegedly. And then his shot's all out of whack, doesn't really get playing time. Then, then there's injuries, whether they're real or not, you know. I think his latest shoulder injury was real, but there was some like where maybe there was like fake injuries just to, just so he can settle down, work on the, I, I mean, I don't know. There's a lot of crazy things happening in, in the Fultz world. There could be a 30 for 30 on this. EA saying typical UW player. I did, Scott. My father is a Jaspi employee. All right. We got Al Farouk Aminu, tie-dye, 7 out of 25. Love these tie dyes. Trailblazers, Ryan Redmond. We got Bruce Brown, 19 out of 99. 1999, that's Prince. Jersey and autograph. Pistons, that goes to Phillip. about Grayson Allen? What, what, is he, what does he do for the Jazz? Chris Dunn to 
Lonzo Ball. Lakers could use could use him. Or could have used him, I guess. Lonzo may as well just chill at this point. 25 to 25. Die cut. Tie dye die cut. Lonnie Walker, the fourth, even. There's three other Lonnie Walkers. That goes to uh, Melanie and the Spurs. There you go, Melanie. Okay, there's Markel Fultz again. There's Isaiah Thomas, Cavs edition. That will go to Isaac, who got the Cavs in a spot random. There's DiVincenzo. And Kobe, 97 out of 99. Select swatches. That goes to Elvis Ekman and my Lakers. Game war material. Very nice. Jamal Murray die cut for the Nuggets. Darren McKenzie, D Mac with the Nugs. Yeah, the, those tie dyes, rookie tie dyes, do sell well, John. You're right. Love that design, too. 175. EA is wondering, Eric's wondering will, if John Ross III will, will live up to his potential. All right. Next box. See ya. Scott saying cheap on points in these case? Are you saying you want more points in these? You might be the first person, Scott, to have said they want more points, more Panini points in cases. Most people don't don't like the points at all. All right. Luka Doncic, die cut. Blue. Robert Throne with the Mavs. 120 out of 249. Dirk Nowitzki is teammate to 175. Is Dirk officially retiring or is he going to go another year? Or has he not specified? He could, I guess. Dirk Nowitzki, Luka Doncic, and Kristaps Porzingis on the court together? That'd be kind of cool. Out of 175 on that one, Robert. Rajon Rondo, Michael Kidd Gilchrist, Miles Bridges, and it's a Knox in the box. Kevin Knox on card autograph for the Knicks. That'll be for Sky. Sky Dunn with the New York Knickerbockers. Nice. 65 out of 199. And more Luka Doncic, Draft Selections Relic. There you go, your third overall pick. Evan Fournier to 299. 
Patrick Goodwin asking, do I see a Luka Doncic autograph card? Yes, your eyes do not deceive you. There he is, Lulu. And Alan Crabb and Goyle, X Factor relic for Tony and the Nets. And Porzingis, his future teammate. Two boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. EA speculating that uh, that Porzingis cards are kind of cheap right now. And he thinks that the Pony will do better in Dallas. I think so. He just got to stay healthy, right? But yeah. He'll be ha he'll seem it seems like he'll be happier in Dallas. I think he was very happy with the Knicks organization. If he's healthy. Him, Luka, among others. Dallas has a good draft. Maybe... Pick up a, a free agent or two. I don't know how much cap space they have, but. There's Michael Porter Jr. die cut to 249. That's for D Mac and the Nuggets. Two forty-nine. Andre Drummond is your X Factor relic for Philip and the Pistons. There he is. Jaron Jackson Jr. Nice relic there. I like that design. Grizz Anthony. That's a good question, actually. I don't know, Chris. Doncic and Porzingis? Are they from the same country? No, I think I think Porzingis is like Lithuanian, right? And Doncic is like Croatian or Serbian. There's Jaron Jackson Jr. 299. Is Porzingis Latvian, maybe? Am I being am I being racist right now? People from the Balkans are like, what, do you think we all look alike? Oh, St Doncic is Slovenian? And where does Porzingis hail from, Ray? All right, confirmed, Slovenian. John Raposo also saying Slovenian. There's Brooke Lopez. One out of 99, die cut. I know, I'm just being racist, Rory. Do, do all Eastern Europeans look alike? I'm that, I'm that guy now. They do, Rory, because I, I don't see color, Rory. Everyone looks alike to me. I don't see color. Jersey and Auto, Elliot Kobu, 85 out of 99, Jersey and Autograph. Phoenix Suns for Ryan Sullivan. Porzingis, EA Singh is Latvian. Or Lithuanian, says Ray. KD, red, to 199. Or Latvian, corrects Ray. 
I wish there was like a, a database that collects all this information that we can access from anywhere in the world, that where we can f determine this, right? It would just be like a, a, a like a, a global net or something like that, a global web, a worldwide web of information that we can access this and look that up whenever we needed to. When they invent that, that's going to be huge. Right. Everyone looks the same to me, Ray. Everyone around the world. Whether they're from Africa, Asia, or Europe, they all look the same to me. I don't see color. Luca today, huh? Luca! You pull who? Oh, nice. I got one too. Oh. Yeah, it is. On car Lulu. Oh, he's around EA. He's around. He is. Doing doing the eBay for us, Rory. Eric Bledsoe, and maybe among other things in the future. Out of 149. Eric Bledsoe, come on, Bucks! I need you to win by ten. I know they're, I know they're, they're leading. You need to lead by more. Jersey and autograph Chandler Hutchinson, Bulls. That goes to Jeremy thirty three. The Chicago Bulls. Jeremy thirty three got the Bulls in a spot random. Nice. Wendell Carter Jr. at a one seventy five. LeBron James. Right there. You can say hi right there, Rory. Joe Babcock, what's going on? I think those LeBron James is in his Lakers gear. They actually do pretty well on a secondary market, Lakers. So kind of check that out. Uh, like Elvis Ekman with the... Lakers, Kevin Love, LeBron's former teammate to 299. Let's see what we got here to close this break out. There's Nicola Batum, die cut to 249. And Marcin Gortat, Wizards, Relic for Scott. The very end, Scott, a little something. At least you're not skunked. And Rory, Rory's behind on all the Jaspi news. Where have you been, Rory? And Trey Young, two-color Relic for the Hawks. Jeremy 33 with Atlanta Hawks gets the last hit out of this break. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. That was a full case break of select basketball. That was pick your team number three. Thanks for joining, and we'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.